Yo, what's going on everyone? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can make over $1 million in GTA 5 online every single hour. Now, I guarantee every single person watching this video is going to be able to do this money method because you only need one requirement and I'm pretty sure every single person watching this video already owns it. But before getting into the video, if you guys do want to enjoy, make sure you guys do me a favor and drop a like and also hit that subscribe button if you guys aren't subscribed already. But without further ado, let's get into this really, really overpowered money guide. So like I said, you only need one requirement for this money method and that one requirement is going to be right behind me. Now the requirement you guys need is going to be any single apartment that you guys can start up any one of the Leicester heists in. Once you guys own one of these apartments, which I'm pretty sure you guys already own, you're now going to want to enter inside of it and make your way over to the heist room. Now hopefully you guys don't have any heist started up if you guys do have a heist started up you guys can just go outside of your apartment call lester and then cancel the heist then come back in and now you guys should be able to start up any one of these now what you guys want to do is start up this one specific heist and i'm gonna show you guys which one that is going to be right here so just go up to your board click right d-pad and you're going to want to start up the very first one right here the felisa job heist if you guys are wondering why i'm telling you guys to start up this one even though it pays the least out of all these that is because this week in gta 5 the felisa job heist is going to be paying double money at double rp and it actually pays pretty good especially if you fast run it like i do and don't ask why i said fast run i know it's speed run but basically if you guys speed run this heist you guys can do it in anywhere from 15 to 20 minutes and at the end you'll see how much money you guys get and that's how much money you can get every 15 to 20 minutes anyways let me prove to you guys that it actually took me 15 to 20 minutes take a look at the time right here it is 11 18 p.m 11 18 keep that time in mind because at the very end of the heist i'm going to show you guys the time and you guys are going to see it only took me around 15 minutes to complete which is insane and you guys can easily do this as well well, the Felisa job heist is a very easy heist to do. For this first setup, I don't even have to tell you guys what to do. Literally, all you do is drive over to the bank, you scope out the bank, you drive back to Lester's factory, you get in this car, and then you drive this car over to your apartment, and that is literally it. You are done with the very first setup. We only have one more, and then we have the finale heist to do. You guys can see, setup finally passed. I started this first setup at 11.18 p.m. like I showed you guys, and take a look at the time right here once I actually show you guys here in a second, once I pull up my uh, actual Xbox home button, you can see right here. Take a look at the time, 11.24. It literally only took me six minutes to complete the very first setup. And next, we only have one more to do. Now, if you guys haven't noticed already for both of these setups and also the finale heist you do need one other person to do this with you so if you guys have a friend who's down to speed run this heist and go back to back with you you guys can actually be earning a pretty good amount of money and he's actually earning a pretty decent amount of money as well he's only going to be earning around a hundred thousand dollars less than you so you'll be earning around a million dollars an hour he'll be earning around eight hundred to seven hundred thousand dollars an hour but if you guys were to go back to back you guys could probably make it even and if you guys can do it faster than i do here with my friend you guys can make of course faster money than I did. Anyway, for this setup, I'm sure you guys know how this setup works. All you have to do is drive to this location, take out all the enemies, get inside the armored Karuma, and then drive the armored Karuma all the way back over to Lester's factory and basically park it there. As you guys can see, the time is 11:26, so it literally only took me like two minutes to take out all those enemies and then deliver it over to Lester's factory. I'm constantly going to be showing you guys the time as well, just so you guys can just basically have proof for how fast it actually takes to complete the Felisa job heist. Even though I'm pretty sure you guys already know the Felisa job heist is very, very easy to speed run, especially if you guys do it with a friend who knows what he's doing. Anyway, you guys can see we just finished doing the second setup and now we are officially done with both setups. Now we only have one more thing to do and that is the finale heist. As you guys can see, the time is 11.28 so it only took me 4 minutes to do the second setup. So in total it took me around 10 minutes to do both setups. Now 10 minutes to do both setups, now you have the finale heist to do, and when it comes to the actual percentage, this is when it comes to how much money you guys can get. Now if you guys want to give yourself the full 70% cut that you guys can actually give yourself, you guys will be earning $352,000 every time you do this heist. But if you want to do it fair, 60-40, you're going to be making $300,000 and your friend's going to be making $200,000. I just recommend doing it like that. Even if you do it this way, you're still going to be making a million dollars an hour, and your friend is going to be making around eight hundred to $700,000 an hour by doing it with you. Anyway, take a look at the time it's 11 32 so i literally basically completed the fleece job heist in around i think it took me like 15 to 20 minutes it definitely was below 20 minutes here at the end of the video i'll see how long it actually took at the very end anyway i'm pretty sure you guys know how the finale to the felisa job heist works literally all you have to do is drive over to the factory where you park the karuma get in the karuma bring it over to the bank and then enter inside of the bank and of course rob it i'm pretty sure you guys already know how to rob it if you guys are the driller you have to go back here right here to where you have to drill into the deposit box and once you guys drill through the deposit box you will get the money that is 
in the deposit box or at least i think there's money inside of there i'm not actually too sure maybe one of you guys can let me know down below in the comment section what is actually in this uh safety deposit box hopefully it's money i don't know something definitely valuable because we are making three hundred thousand dollars every time we do this heist and our friend is going to be making right around the same amount just a little bit shorter around two hundred thousand dollars every time we do this heist and he's also going to be making money for the both setups that we end up doing at the beginning and i also forgot to mention the fact that both setups during the fleece job heist your friend is going to be getting paid money and both of those setups are also paying double money and double rp so the fleece job heist is paying double money and double rp and also every single heist setup for actually all the heist at the lester heist inside your apartment are paying double money and double rp but the only finale heist that's paying double money and double rp is of course the fleece job heist that's why we are covering it in this video anyway i've done enough talking now i have successfully robbed the safety deposit box and now i have the valuable box now what i'm going to do is go ahead and enter inside the karuma and now i just have to make my getaway and we are completely done with the fleece job heist hopefully you guys now know how you could speed run this fleece job heist even though i'm pretty sure you guys already know how to do that it's literally the easiest heist to do you don't even have to be good to speed run this anyway look at the time right here it is 11 37 so i think we're just slightly above 15 minutes just a little bit over 15 minutes uh doing this heist i think it took like a total of 19 minutes yeah so it took 19 minutes for me to complete this heist i think maybe Maybe 18 minutes let's just go ahead and say 18 minutes it took me 18 minutes to complete this fleece job heist and i'm pretty sure you guys can do it even faster than i did so every single 18 minutes 15 to 20 minutes we'll just say like that you guys are going to be making three hundred thousand dollars and your friends going to be making two hundred thousand dollars every single time you complete it and if you guys were to do this back to back to back you guys could be making yourself anywhere from one to 1.2 million dollars every single hour if you guys are fast enough Here's the money I ended up getting though. You can see the potential take is $503,000. We sadly did not do the elite challenge. I'm pretty sure if you guys complete the elite challenge, you guys get a little extra bit of money. But even if I didn't complete it, here's how much money I got, $301,000, just like I said. And if you guys were to do the math, it took me around 18 minutes to do this heist. If I were to do this back to back, I could be making anywhere from 1 to 1.2 million, like I just said, every single hour. And if you guys are wondering how long it actually takes for Lester to call you back and get the other heist working, it takes like anywhere from five, maybe it takes like a total, maybe five minutes at max for him to call you back. And once he calls you back to start up the next heist, what you guys can actually do is go back to your apartment and start up the exact same heist that you just did, the Felisa job heist, and run it back to back to back. You're honestly just better off doing that because you can speed run it. It's super simple and you're making $300,000 every 20 minutes. So yeah, this money method is super overpowered. Definitely make sure you guys do it this week. If you guys don't have anybody to do this heist with, what you guys can do is go down below in the comment section of this video and comment down below your Xbox or your PlayStation gamer tag and you guys can link up with each other in the comment section and do this heist together. But yeah, that's going to be it for me. I hope you guys did go on to enjoy today's video. If you guys did go on to enjoy, make sure you guys do me a favor and drop a like and also hit that subscribe button if you guys aren't subscribed already. And that's it for me. I will see you guys in my next video. Peace.